Hi, my name is Katrina Verdusco. I live in Tucson, Arizona, and I graduated from the U of A, and I'm the first one in my family to go to college. I never knew that I was low income until I had to check that box. My parents split up when I was 11, and for me that just meant I had to grow up very quickly. It leads to natural leadership. It genuinely creates a sense of responsibility. And with that comes challenges because not only do you want to make yourself proud, but you want to make your family proud. And there was a time when I had received an email saying that I wasn't going to receive my scholarships anymore. And that was something that really hurt. I just felt like I let my family down. But thankfully, I was exposed to the scholarship program Earn to Learn my senior year in high school, which emphasized saving. For me, I would save $50 until I met my $500 requirement, and then they would reward me with a $4,000 scholarship. Coming from a low-income family, saving is not something that we could focus on. And for Earn to Learn to show me that was very inspiring for me. I remember applying for all the scholarships that I needed to apply for, and Earn to Learn was that last puzzle piece that I needed. And I was so happy. I immediately called my mom in the morning, and she just couldn't believe that I went through something like that by myself. She just told me that she really wished that I would have told her because she would have been right there by my side crying with me. And it was very overwhelming because <laughs> because I couldn't understand why she was upset and sad. But again, being a very strong woman, I could understand. But I told her it's okay because I took care of it. <laughs> and thankfully I had programs like Earn to Learn and the U of A to support me through this process because without them, I honestly, I don't know what I would have done. Like a month later, my mom, she shared this necklace with me and I immediately started crying because on the necklace it said, she believed she could, so she did. And those were the most inspirational words I could ever receive from my mom. I would just like to say thank you to everybody who participates in continuing to fund these programs. And just know that not only do you play a part in my life, but my siblings' life, my family's life, and for future generations to come. So thank you so much for just believing in us.